one full bagel with some MTS and Cool Whip sludge. I actually went right back to sleep after that bagel because I didn't go to bed till like one last night. I laid in bed awake for like four hours. What's that about? All right, so what we're doing here is we're making protein fluff. All right, as you know, two hours before workout, pre-workout as they call it, we need to uh, reestablish liver glycogen levels. So we got two cups of strawberries, roughly, and just some leftover frozen berries. These are frozen too. Uh, we're gonna mix in some French vanilla, coffee syrup, and I couldn't find my honey, so we're gonna do agave. And it's gonna be delicious. So, also, I forgot to mention, um, a scoop of banana nut way, because I thought the flavor would match well. You just put everything in the bowl, um, mix in very little milk as needed, and as Michael Jackson says, you just beat it. Beat it. Nope, look at all those chunks. Is it done yet? Does that even look fluffy? And there you have it. Pretty much doubles in size and it's just fluff. Woo! What a workout. Feeling mighty depleted. There's a guy in there today, and I know everybody like, you know, you make noise when you lift. Well, you should if you're lifting hard. You know, I get a little grunt going, you probably heard in that clip, but this guy was like, I thought he was like gonna full on transform. He sounded like a, some sort of robot. He was doing uh, skull crushers, and every time he went down, he was like, <sighs> What? So here's what we got going on in here. We got a scoop of the s'mores with a scoop and a half of uh, the carbion. Why a scoop and a half, you might be wondering. Because, I think this is it. We got a uh, half a frozen nanner. It looks brown, but you know, that's just because it's been in the freezer, so it's still good. Mmm. Oh, that is good. Let the carb load begin. A little pro tip for all you guys out there. Um, no matter the question, the answer is comb over. All right, it's the hairstyle that's been tested by time. This is in the 90s, and this is in middle school. So the answer is, you know. What's going on, guys? I'm on my way right now um, over to my father's house, Casa de mi Padre, and we are going to go to a beer tasting class, so that'll be fun. We do this like, uh, I think they offer it once a month at my local, what's the classy term for a store that sells wine and beer? A beerery? A winery? It's called Total Wine, but they offer a class once a month, and this is like our bonding thing. So. What a coincidence, it just happened to fall on a carb reefy day. <laughs> it's almost like I planned it out. So that's perfect. Um, so we're headed over there now. They usually have like snacks and stuff there, pizza. I'm probably gonna try to stay away from it, but you know, it's kind of hard to control the cravings once uh, you get a few in you. And it's not like you're just like drinking there. They have a new taste, new taste. It's classy, very classy. 
So um, last week I went to go get an x-ray because I may or may not have broken a rib and they have yet to... Whoop. All right, driving filming's hard. Uh, they have yet to... Whoop. They have yet to call me back and tell me if I have a broken rib or not. So that is A plus doctoring. It's leaving me hanging. But you know, it is what it is. The crosses we must bear. Catch you later when I got food and stuff going on. Well, Turner, I'm currently at a car service. Oh, what's going on? I just hit the up the uh, each week. pub like club. After my beer class, which was awesome, by the but way, I, I know that um, got some tasty right treats for dinner and dessert tonight, so get ready, get excited. Just on the way to visit my nan, which is my grandmother, um, and then I will get to cooking, which I know is what you guys like. Like to see food, like to see me eat food, like to see me lift weights, but not driving. Driving and filming. All Very dangerous. All so just got home. Um, I'm gonna make dessert first. I know, what a bad boy, dessert before dinner. But it's just because um, it takes longer to make and I have to let it sit for a while. So we're gonna make that first, eat dinner first, of course, because <sighs> it only makes sense. And then we're gonna have dessert. I just got these bad boys in the mail today. These uh, Blue Buds headphones. And it's not that I've never had them before, it's just that I had to return them twice under warranty. But these are the best workout headphones if you're uh, in the market for something to wear. As you can see here, they just kind of strap around the head. And they're just like earbuds, but they're wireless. And they freaking rock. Noise canceling, which, believe me... I need some noise canceling in the gym. I'm getting tired of hearing like the same 10 songs, like literally the same 10 songs. I probably know all the words to them by now and I hate all of them. It's like none of those songs are good for working out uh, except one. It's like, uh, you know the one, it's like, been lifted, lifting, lifting every single night. You know that one? But it sounds like she's saying I've been lifting every single night. So I'm like, oh yeah, that's relatable. So this is what we're going to be rocking with. Unfortunately, it's fat-free, and I need some more fats today. But the thing I like about it is you don't need any eggs or oil or butter. You just need water to make it, which is good because I don't have eggs right now. But instead of water, we're either going to do cream soda, diet, or vanilla Coke Zero. Maybe both. I'll have to measure it out. But either way, <laughs> it's going to be good. Spoiler alert, I used half of each. Alright, so we got chocolate pudding, fat-free, sugar-free, banana cream, is that what it is? And then, whoops, into each, we're gonna put half of this container, so this whole container is going in here. Fat-free Cool Whip, pub brand. So this one isn't chocolatey enough, so we're gonna add some special dark. And this one isn't delicious enough, so we're gonna add some baby doo waiting for food is the worst part about food and before I was under the assumption that uh, there are no bad parts about food but waiting for it definitely a downside so I'm um, activating nerd mode here I'm gonna watch some uh, Dragon Ball I don't know if you can see that I can't even see that so that's gonna be me doing my thing Pretty close. Pretty close. Alright, so I know a trifle cake is supposed to be made in like a large glass see-through, like a trifle container, but I don't have one of those. And I'm gonna be eating it, not presenting it, so I don't really care. So here's what we got going on. This angel food cake did not puff up at all. Look at that, it's all like really thick, but you know what? We're gonna make it work in this bowl from earlier. It's gonna be so good. So you got cake pudding, then we're gonna layer Cheerios, and then repeat with the cake, other pudding, and chocolate Cheerios. 
The real question is, why did I even think I could make anything like even semi-professional looking? So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna make this big bowl of mess. We're gonna call it Tyler's Big Bowl of Mess. All these great ideas for food and they just, unprofessional presentation. You think you can do all these things, Nemo, but you can't. I honestly don't know how I'm gonna eat all this. Like, this is a big bowl. Let me show you like, comparison. All right, so this is my head, and this is the bowl. This is, this is a lot of dessert, a lot of carbs. But I believe, I believe. This is the last bite. No, it wasn't. I'm not even halfway done. I'm being a little baby right now. So tired. Whew. Eating is exhausting. Wow. Well, let's uh, give the old macaronis a look-see. Macros is what I meant. Well, here we go. Total fat, 57, not bad. Carbs, 732, a little over what I wanted. Uh, protein was like 40 over what I was shooting for, but you know, sometimes you just do what it do. Not the button I wanted. Ooh, diary. No, big old thumbs. So here we go. This is everything. I don't know. <laughs> Who are you kidding, my fitness pal? Snacks. This is just where desserts go. So that's today, 4,087. Whoa, wrong way. All in all, shh, not trying to flex, but whatever. Just, just comfortable. This is how it's comfortable for me. All in all, I'd uh, call today a successful refeed. So go ahead and like, subscribe, tell all your friends, demand they do the same. And uh, catch you next week.